Alright guys, today we're going to go over fixing the table of contents for a novel uh, or a book that you're uploading to KDP, to uh, Amazon for publishing. Um, this is uh, the print section. The Kindle section seems to be okay with just using the Word file, but when you go to the print section and you upload it, many times if you have a table of contents, you can see here the table of contents, we've got the gutters set up, we've got the margins set up, everything set up correctly. But when you actually upload it and put it into um, their system here in the uh, kdp.amazon.com, it shows that the table of contents falls way outside the actual uh, page, which it doesn't. Um, actually, if you look through the book, everything's set up correctly. It's just that there's an error with the automatically generated tables of contents um, with Word, and they're not really compatible with the KDP system. But there's a super simple fix. I uh, faced this before when I published my book, and um, as I'm running into it again uh, with an update, I figured I'd go over it with you guys. So the simplest way to get around this, because this is a, um, a print book and not a Kindle book, all you need to do is save your file as a PDF. Then it'll kind of stick everything in place right where it's supposed to be. And we'll go ahead and save it. We're going to replace that old file. All right. So now we have a PDF file that we can then put directly into KDP. All right, so let's minimize that, go out of there. Okay, good, good, good. We're going to go back. All right. Exit print previewer. And we're going to go to upload paperback manuscript. And we wait. All right. It's checking our cover. There it is. Next. Okay table of contents looks perfect. So that's how you fix the table of contents falling outside of the margins on uh, KDP when you're uploading your book on uh, for Kindle and print. Hope you guys enjoyed. Is it too good to be true? I want this so much but don't know if I can trust you. My mind's racing fast, trying to find the red flags I'm used to.